Welcome. Thanks so much for joining us today. I'm with Dean Courtney Fletcher of the College of Pharmacy, and we're about to go on a tour of the new building. Courtney, lead on. Thank you very much. Well, Chancellor Gold, I'd like to welcome you to the new home of the College of Pharmacy, the UNMC Center for Drug Discovery and Logier Center for Pharmacy Sciences and Education. Well, thank you so much. Uh, I can't wait to have a look. And, well, it's a magnificent building. It is three floors, uh, a football field long each, and for our products, if you will, which are the creation of knowledge and then the dissemination of that knowledge to prepare talent, pharmacists, uh, to provide uh, meet the healthcare needs of Nebraska and basic and clinical pharmaceutical sciences to help solve uh, uh, needed uh, medication needs for patients. This building is a perfect example of form following function. So I'd like to start the tour up on our third floor, which is the UNMC Center for Drug Discovery, uh, where we're focused on the creation of new knowledge. Well, let's see where new drugs are discovered. This is one of the three suites of labs uh, uh, on this floor. Th this one's focused on medicinal chemistry, on the design and the synthesis of new compounds. As a general style, it follows the design as you see in the Durham Research Centers 1 and 2 with open labs, their flexible design, but what is unique is uh, the number of hoods. That's the tool of today's medicinal chemist, to be able to design new compounds. And where the standard model at UNMC is one fume hood in every other lab, um, these labs have four fume hoods per lab. So it allows a type of intensive chemistry synthesis that's not found on this campus and is really found in very, very few other buildings around, uh, around the country. But once you uh, have a new compound, then the next challenge becomes how are we going to deliver it into the body? So the second suite of labs that we have in this building then focus exactly on the drug delivery. Whether that might be as simple as a tablet or as capsule or as complicated or complex as the new smart drug delivery systems such as nano formulations, uh, ways that drugs can target uh, ways that we can target exactly where we drug we want the drug to go in the body. So it's not as simple anymore as just creating a tablet or a capsule. It's about not just having the new drug but how to get it delivered in a safe and effective and enduring way, I it, understand. That's exactly right and this is, uh, it, it falls into the area of precision medicine that's, uh, I don't need to tell you, but it's an important focus for UNMC as well as for the National Institutes of, of, uh, of Health now and it's how we're going to solve some of the really difficult to treat uh, diseases um, by using the right drug and getting it exactly to the right space we need it in the body. So after the new drugs are formulated and the delivery systems are worked out, what comes after that? After that, it's the clinical and translational science part. And that is the third suite of labs uh, that are in this building. Um, we think within this floor, we now have, uh, we have the facilities, we have the infrastructure uh, uh, and, and the talent uh, to really in some ways function as like a small pharmaceutical company with the discovery of drugs, with the development of drugs, and then working on the clinical and translation of those drugs into meeting healthcare needs uh, for, for patients, not just in Nebraska, but throughout the world. Well, Dr. Gold, I'd now like to welcome you to the Logier Center for Pharmacy Sciences and Education. So we're standing now in one of the two large uh, auditoria for uh, uh, this, uh, this building. It looks in many ways just like a regular auditorium, but the technology in this room, uh, the way we're going to deliver content much more digitally, there is an identical twin uh, to, this, uh, to this second, uh, to this large auditorium. Then we have uh, two what we call large classrooms, two medium classrooms, then about 12 uh, small group work rooms mm -hmm. for our students. Well, Chancellor Gold, uh, we're now on the first floor uh, of the building. And so if the second floor is where we teach the theory of pharmacy, First floor is going to be where we provide the tools, so where we uh, uh, educate the students in how to be a pharmacist, from the uh, 
art of pharmacy part, the dispensing, the compounding, whether that be non-sterile or sterile product uh, compounding, uh, to the tools that they need to interact uh, with patients on the simulation and patient exam side of the building, and uh, uh, ending here with uh, the counseling of, uh, of a patient, whether that would be in over-the-counter uh, drug products uh, or in prescription products. This first floor is really the tool part of preparing pharmacists. I know a lot of hard work has gone into the planning, but without the generosity of the donors, without their vision and their willingness to invest in the College of Pharmacy, and their willingness to invest in the future of the University of Nebraska Medical Center, this wouldn't have been possible. So thank you so much, and thanks for the great tour. I look forward to the next time. Thank you very much. Thank you.